Hello and welcome everyone to our show Neat S600 where we talk about secrets of scoring more than 600 marks in the Neat exam. Every student would have a dream college aur us dream college mein jaane ke liye what you need is a good score. Today we will focus on one subject which is physics. How with the help of physics we would be able to score more than 600 marks. And to educate us on this topic we have with us a subject expert Nabin Kargi sir. Nabin sir, welcome to our show. Thank you Kamal sir. It's both an honor and privilege to be a part of such a big platform. Nabin sir is a faculty of Akash Institute and comes with a teaching experience of more than 16 years. And with the depth of his experience, we are going to understand how we can score more than 600 marks with the help of physics as a subject. Nabin sir, physics se bachche bohat darte hain. फिजिक्स में न्यूमेरिकल्स भी हैं फार्मूला भी है तो क्या फिजिक्स सही में इतना टफ सब्जेक्ट है बिल्कुल नहीं इफ आई सम अप इन वन वर्ड इट इज सिंपली अ फियर दैट हैज बीन पास्ड फ्रॉम जनरेशन टू जनरेशन अगर हम टेक्निकल एनालिसिस में जाएंगे अगर हम इस सब्जेक्ट को एनालाइज करेंगे एट द एंड वी वुड सी द क्लाउड वुड गो अवे एंड एक्चुअली स्कोरिंग सिक्स प्लस यूजिंग फिजिक्स एज अ लेवरेज would not be a difficult task. Thank you. Thank you for saying that, sir. Ki physics tough hai ye ek myth hai. There has to be a strategy. If we have the right strategy, we would be able to score good marks. Sir, wo strategy pe thoda baat karte hai. So, if we have to score more than 600 marks in the NEET exam, how much score a student would need in physics? That's a nice question. So, we'll start with the quantitative analysis. The target is of total 600 marks and we have four subjects. Agar hum ek simple arithmetic average bhi nikalenge, the figure comes out to be 150 per subject. But giving that small discount to physics, I would say if someone scores even 130 or anything higher than 130, then scoring 600 total will not be a trouble. That would be an easy entry into that 600 plus club. All right. So if we score more than 130 plus in physics, there are high chances that we would be able to score more than 600 marks. Sir, ye 130 plus ka score kaise aayega? Is pe kya strategy honi chahiye students ki? So now the target is fixed. Let's start with the strategy. Wo kehte hai na ki begin with the end in mind. So let us try to see the overall structure of the question paper. Now we'll focus only in physics. We have total 45 questions. Main ek rough breakdown kar leta hon. The figure can have plus minus 5% of variation. So out of 45 questions, 30 questions are very straightforward, theory based. And even if mathematics is involved, little bit of arithmetic and algebra, kafi ek comfortable mode mein student solve kar sakta hai. The remaining 15 questions is there. So out of that 10 questions, would require a milder mathematics. Kahin kahin calculus ya maybe a little bit of complex algebra would be required. But they are not difficult. All right. And that remaining five questions. Yes, these questions are formed by merging and fusing multiple concepts. And maybe higher mathematics would be required. Lekin ek interesting baat mein aapko batana chahun, ki actually the entire phobia against physics is formed by these five questions. This is the unfortunate part. Students just focus on that five questions and create a phobia against the subject, whereas they miss the opportunity to score and to get the marks from those 40 questions. So 40 questions are there. If someone focuses on this, then you know, 600 plus becomes a very reasonable achievable target all right so with the help of these 40 questions students would be able to score more than 130 marks in physics sir iska thoda sa strategy samajhna chahenge ki ye 30 questions ko crack karne ke liye then 10 questions and then 5 questions yes iske liye kaun si books ko refer karna chahiye it's an open secret and my first bet would go on ncrt if someone strictly focuses on this you know that 30 and maybe 5 from that next slot out of that 10 scoring that is not at all difficult 
However, there is a little bit of catch. Lot many times kya hota hai? NCRT ka jo paragraph hai, usko decode karna ya usko decipher karne mein students find a little bit of trouble. That's bit in a subjective way. So, you know, there is a very clever solution that has been devised by our caste system. In our study module, the opening questions are always based on NCRT. The paragraphs, the statements, whatever are there, those subjective part has been transformed into objective questions. And you know, even there is a little bit of slippage, there is a little bit of miss while studying the book. When someone solves that question, a given candidate is forced to give the due attention where it is required. So for those first 30 questions, NCRT and the support that our booklet gives, that is going to take care. Okay. So what about those 10 and 5 questions which are of, you know, difficult level? So for those next 10 questions, let's go to the next slab. There's also another supplementary book by NCRT. They call it NCRT Exemplar, a collection of really wonderful questions. So I would say someone should solve that NCRT exemplar and side by side should supplement with the questions of level 2 that is provided in Akash booklet. Because lot many times what happens is that certain areas, certain concepts are not so wonderfully touched by NCRT exemplar. So we have seen those lacunae, we have seen those gap or uni gap or vacancy ko fill karne ke liye level 2 questions hamare booklets agar koi solve kare i would say it's almost a guaranteed feature to wonderfully score in those remaining 10 as well all right sir sir ye jo 30 questions hain 10 questions hain aur jo 5 questions hain yes isme kitna theory rehta hai kitna numerical rehta hai student ka focus kahan pe hona chahiye theory pe zyada hona chahiye ya numerical pe zyada hona chahiye ya fir it has to be a blend of it well, theory is the necessary condition, but not the sufficient. Because our prime target motive is 600 plus. So in order to score 600 plus, without mathematical backing, it would not be possible. It is something like, wo kehte hai ki ignition ke liye, you require a mixture of petrol and air both. So something like the theory and numerical, a nice admixture is required. So the importance of numerical is absolutely there there is not a single question about it sir jo students abhi prepare kar rahe hain who have just started preparing for the neat exam right unke liye kya strategy honi chahiye this is the most you know decisive phase of your preparation journey because students generally they find a cultural shock class 10 tak kya hota hai ki class mein jo padhaya gaya hai board mein jo likha gaya hai the same thing appears in your examination paper लेकिन यहां आप कांसेप्ट क्लास में पढ़ेंगे और उस कांसेप्ट को अप्लाई करके आपको न्यूमेरिकल सॉल्व करना होगा एग्जामिनेशन में ऑलराइट right. और उसके ऊपर देयर आर न्यूअर मैथमेटिक्स व्हिच वुड कम लाइक कैलकुलस ग्राफ्स एंड अदर थिंग्स सो यस आई एग्री इनिशियल लेवल वुड बी अ बिट चैलेंजिंग बट दिस इज द टाइम वेयर यू नीड टू परसिस्टेंटली गिव योर एफर्ट और सीखते जाएं एंड दिस फेज विल सून बी ओवर ऑलराइट सर and what about those who are nearing this exam, who are in the 12th and they are about to write the exam, unka kya focus rehna chahiye? Now, by that time, they must have already covered the syllabus. So, it's all about consolidation. Like beginning phase, mein, you can't afford to leave even a single chapter. But I don't mean to say that you have leave karna hai, but now you have to sort it out. Pehle, you start approaching and you start practicing those areas where you have questions bante, and score ko upar badhane ke liye they are very much instrumental jaise ki modern physics ray optics mechanics electrodynamics these are the topics from where lot many questions are formed so they are decisive having said that i don't mean that the other topics have to be left but yes this is the preparation order in which you can go so the final phase is a consolidation one all right sir thoda guidance lena chahenge about mock test how these tests actually help us in gearing up for the final exam immense in the language of physics infinitely high in fact test exposure does a mental conditioning to you so examination is a time where you use your knowledge and you also show your mental strength and that does not come in a single day rome was not built in a single day it was a gradual effort 
So in the beginning, like Akash ecosystem, may we start with the fortnightly test. Those are simple questions that helps you to manage the time, that helps you to gather confidence. And after that, the three hours test, like the monthly term test, and that will give you another exposure that will take you one step higher. Then there is a very wonderful test series. We call it AIATS, All India Akash Test Series. That is a must for any need aspirant. Okay. Kamal sir, I'll tell you a statistic that AIATS ka jo ranking it is so authentic. Maan lete aap AIATS mein aapka rank 50 aata hai. So in a very high probability, your rank in the main need would be at around 50. Maybe plus minus 10% tolerance, that degree of uncertainty always has to be kept. But with this, I want to show the importance of this testing pattern. Or the mock test, hai, full syllabus test, hai, they create a virtual environment and they condition the mental level of student to such a great degree final days of examination they ne bacha jayega the student would feel that yes it's a regular day ha mai test dene apna center ja raha tha usi tarah ka ek feeling aana chahiye wo level ke conditioning chahiye to wo kehte hai na ki the more you sweat in peace less you bleed in war wow so with the help of these tests students ko ye pata lagta hai ki unka performance hai kitna this is basically an actual mirror of your performance right all right great thank you sir thank you so much and i am sure with the kind of guidance which sir has given to us if we follow that we will be able to score more than 600 marks in the neat exam in this episode we have spoken about physics in the next episodes we are going to talk about other subjects till then keep practicing and stay tuned